Greetings, and welcome to the old school runescape. Today, we are doing the quest called Vampire Slayer. In this quest, a vampire is slain by you. You may need to go through rigorous combat training before beginning as a vampire is a difficult boss. You will also need a couple of coins and an anvil striker. To begin, talk with a boy named Morgan in Drainer Village. He has recently watched the Twilight movie and was so appalled that the only way to make things right for the world is to slay Edward Cullen himself. I can't say I have any problems with that. He tells you to meet his friend in Varrock, but first, go upstairs, kill this woman who may or may not be a thief, and steal one garlic from Morgan's cupboard. We'll be making some pasta later, so of course we will need garlic bread to go with it. Now meet Dr. Harlow in the Blue Moon Inn. That's in Varrock in case you've forgotten. He has been drinking recently in preparation for the upcoming heart surgery he's about to perform. Before he will spill the beans on the secrets of vampire slaying, he will need another drink. Purchase one alcohol from the bartender and give it to the nice doctor. This will allow him to remember how to fight teenage vampires. He will tell you that you need garlic in your inventory in order to weaken Edward because it makes his breath smell funny, thus reducing his sex appeal. He also recalls that his surgery patient died last Tuesday and he will give you his surgery steak so you can kill Edward Cullen. By the way, that's a sharp, pointy, wooden steak, not a lean tender, beef steak, so don't try eating it unless you're a beaver. Get equipped for the fight of your life. Then head to the Drainer Manor north of the village. Walk downstairs into the basement and open the coffin. This resurrects the dead vampire that we need to kill. Use either cunning tactics or brute force to quickly dispatch the sexy young man. Be careful that he does not expose himself to direct sunlight, or else he will start shining, and you may fall in love, causing you to lust after a fictitious character. When Edward's hit points drop low enough you will automatically use the Anvil Striker to strike a stake into the heart of Edward and consequentially the heart of his fangirls. As he dies, you will obtain 3 quest points and some weapon holding experience. Congratulations! You have now made the world a safer place 